to discover and showcase talented individuals. Entertainment is said to be one of the biggest contributors to the growth of the society and the nation's economy at large. This was made known during a press briefing to unveil the season two of Empire Africa House reality TV show. Organizers said the show will impact Lagos residents in various areas like business, entertainment, lifestyle, public relations, talent harnessing and many more. The project lead of the show, Majesty Samson, who represented the CEO Empire Entertainment, Dixon Aligbea, and the managing director, Deji Yakubu, said the show was born out of passion to promote careers of young Nigerians who are into entertainment, entrepreneurship, and many more. The project's lead added that empowering the nation's teeming youth is vital to job creation and, by extension, economic growth. Empire Entertainment uh, is an industry that we are very versatile. And coming up with the season two of our reality TV show is something that we've been planning for a very long time because we have so much to give out and it's a unique kind of show that it is not like the conventional, you know, reality TV show. That's why we are gathered here today to celebrate the magic of entertainment, an industry that brings us joy, inspires creativity, uplifts and unites all of us. The main objective of the show is to discover and showcase talented individuals who not only excel in their artistic abilities but also demonstrate a commitment to making a positive impact on social on the society through philanthropic projects. Remember that's why I started by saying that we are a give back community. Our goal is to empower the youth in business, entertainment, lifestyle, public relations, and all talent to create a platform where people of different cultural, ethnic, and social status can collaborate, educate, empower themselves, and entertain the viewers through their diverse personalities and intense competition for the ultimate grand prize. Now that is something each and every one of you need to look out for during the show. Now 20, 30 contestants, with outstanding personalities and talents will be selected from auditions from across the nation and housed in the Empire Mansion for an uninterrupted period of 60 days. And there's going to be, there are lots of reality TV shows. And the truth is, the reason why most of the organizers of this show, you know, go ahead to do theirs is quite different. But for us here in Empire, the truth is, organizing a reality TV show is not the issue yet. But the benefit that it's the people start to gain as well as the contestants and that is why we as Empire Entertainment came up with an exclusive reality TV show, The Old Bay Mansion and Tall Boss Show. Contestants will engage in tax on the streets, marketplaces, schools, orphanage homes, offices, just to mention but a few, and in our Empire Tall Boss. So basically what that means is 90% of the show is going to be done on the streets. To you, the main event that is um, coming next year. The main event that is coming up next year, sorry, please. Um, so, I me, mean, which is the principal sponsor now, um, gave us some product out, gave some product out for the promo proper for the event, which is the reason why we are here. We launched the products for, to avail it to the public and talk about the show for them to know that the show is coming up last year and for our meetings on board. Yeah, like I said, this is not uh, a disco-like forum. It's just a media chat to ask you questions. And uh, if you get, want to know more of what uh, we are doing here, you can ask them, we'll explain to you. So in this capacity, I have to have those who spoke at the briefing said the show will expose contestants to the screen while they are also expected to use the platform to build themselves irrespective of whether they emerge as the winner or not. You know, the world is big and we need to nurture our community. We need to nurture the environment so that the universe will be happy with us. You know, giving back, making the universe happy, giving back to its people, you know, empowering the youths, helping old people, helping poor people. It is something that's amazing. What is in our mind is how to make money, not how to give back. So seeing a boss that sees the sufferings of this less privileged Nigerians, if you know what a market woman that all his products for a day is no more than 5,000, 
if she sell that five thousand dollar product, I get from it is just like maybe one thousand or one thousand five, and someone give it fifty thousand, it's just like one billion to her. And now you're empowering them, and now taking these people outside. If you're taking these people outside and showing them that this is life, when you make it, do this to you. Assist people, help people. As you're taking them outside, not just the reality share, taking them outside, they're going to see how people suffer. So if you become this, if you become this tomorrow, you're going to affect people's life. So it's not just even giving back to society, it's teaching the contestants how to give back to society too. Access 24's correspondent Daniel Tanmo reports that the show which will hold in 2025 will house 30 contestants in the mansion for two months. Each of them will be assigned a daily task to prove their worth in winning the grand prize. 